the civic body's initiative to install road dividers with deep pocket-like gaps to grow plants could be creating mosquito breeding spots in the city and suburbs. With several of these median pieces yet to be packed with soil, rainwater has accumulated in them. The little long pools have emerged at a time when the city reported 39 malaria and 7 dengue cases in the first three days of this month. The road divider with cavities have been installed to facilitate plantation and beautification. Midday visited several locations where locals have been complaining of mosquito menace. More such spots in the eastern suburbs. The divider pieces have been neatly placed but none of the red soil needed to grow plants. Instead, all are filled with water and look like drains with no outlet. Besides the dividers with stagnant water, a lot of areas have been dug up for metro work. As a result, the stretch from Pawai Junction to Vikroli Road Junction has become a potential place for mosquito breeding. The dividers along the metro pillars have no soil. Even the barricades have been turned upside down, causing more water to accumulate. At this spot, the BMC has plans to create a small garden. While the borders and edges have been built, there is no soil. It looks like a big tank filled with filth, creating an ideal environment for mosquitoes to grow and spread malaria and dengue. A senior civic official requesting anonymity said that during a meeting to tackle mosquitoes, the municipal commissioner had specifically asked officials and other authorities working in the city to date preventive measures. Subscribe to Midday India. Get direct notifications on all our videos by clicking on the bell icon.